Stereo D is a deluxe company that specializes in high quality conversion of 2D theatrical content to 3D stereoscopic imagery. And what that means in layman's terms is when you go to the movie theater and watch a 3D movie with the glasses on, that's what we do. I'm a technical director here, so what I do in broad terms is I'm a problem solver, sort of a half artist, half programmer. When people have problems with no clear-cut solutions, they come to me. Whether that's a producer who wants to deliver content to a client in a new way, or maybe I'm developing a software for an artist that doesn't exist in off-the-shelf tools. One of the giant leaps that I've made in my career here was the development of a workflow and a subsequent tool that we were able to use in Peter Jackson's World War I documentary, They Shall Not Grow Old. In this film, we took 100-year-old footage that was filmed in World War I. We restored it, we colorized it, and then we converted it into 3D. One of the roles that I had on the film was to create the tool that took the black and white footage and to help colorize it. I worked closely with the producer, the visual effects lead, and the lead restoration artist. When I was at Purdue, I think the number one thing they really equipped me to do was to start off with something with the knowledge that the answer to the problem wasn't going to be given to me and that I was going to have to really work for it. It's certainly been a giant leap for me coming from a really small town in Indiana, moving out to Los Angeles. I never pictured I was going to be able to work on some of these big name movies that you know, I could have only dreamed of being a part of. You know, whether it's Marvel's Doctor Strange, Star Wars The Last Jedi, or even Terminator 2, which came out when I was four years old, that I was fortunate enough to work on when I started at the company. It's really been a dream come true for me. If you're a current student looking to get a job in the field that you're after, be very good at what you do. But what I think is really more important than that is to just be kind and love the people that are around you and really form genuine connections with everyone. Because the world's a pretty small place and the connections that you make now and professionally are the ones that are gonna last you a lifetime. I know for certain I could never have gotten to the place I'm at right now without the, the support and the, the friendships that I made while I was at Purdue.